Hi everyone, EJ here and I'm here to do a book review on Mockingbird by Caitlin Erkshin and this book is about a girl called Caitlin. She is 10 years old and the book revolves around her finding closure and moving on from the death of her brother. She's trying to understand the situation that she's in. Um, the relationship between her and her brother is that they're very very close and because her brother is now gone she's trying to understand everything by herself for um, in the book Devian is like her mentor he teaches her everything and try to make her understand situation that she find difficulties of understanding and the special thing about this book is that comparing it to other moving on and closure type of book it's that and first of all our character is very young and our character is very special she has Asperger syndrome um, Asperger syndrome is the mild autistic disorder and it's a disorder characterized by difficulties in social interaction and nonverbal communication and one of the main difficulties that the author have um, made her character struggle is that she has difficulties on understanding emotional. One of the situation that the author had put Caitlin in is that she has difficulties understanding emotion, putting facial expressions to emotions. For example, if you're happy, we all know that if you're happy, you're smiling, laughing, and if you're sad, you're crying, and you're very quiet. And when you mix both a lot of emotions together, like when you're mad, but you're really, really um, pissed off at someone, and you're angry, and uh, you're annoyed. When you mix those kind of emotions, she find it difficult to point what kind of... I mean, when you put those... I mean, when you put all of those emotions together, and you try to portray through movement and through facial expression, and she just and she will have difficulties of pointing all of those emotions out because it's all in one and she will have a hard time trying to understand it so that's kind of what I think she is that's what I think of Asperger's syndrome and my understanding in the book but if you guys want more research on it you guys can and you guys can tell me in the comment down below so yeah also one of the um, main core of the story that the author had put a character Caitlin in is that she had a hard time making friends because of what how she is and her situation through um different through her difficulties in understanding certain aspects of um, certain aspect of life, so yeah, and it's a really, really great, it's a really, really great book for a middle grade um, story, and I will recommend it to younger audiences to read. It's an easy book to read. It's only what two hundred thirty, two hundred thirty pages. 236 pages so I give this book um, 3 out of 5 star or 3.5 out of 5 stars I give this book that rating because it's something new to me I don't typically read this type of genre mostly middle age middle mostly mostly middle grade book I don't really read this type of realistic type of book. I mostly go to fictions and fantasy and adventure and action. So yeah, it's something new to me. That's why I give that um, that rating. And it's beautifully written and I will recommend it to a lot of 
viewers out there and a lot of readers out there. I will recommend it to a lot of readers out there. It's a great book. It's just that I am very picky when it comes to my rating. So yeah, I give this 3 to 3.5 stars out of 5 stars. So yeah. So yeah, I hope you guys find this review very useful on what you guys can read next and I hope to see you guys soon on my next video and that's it for now. Bye!